Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play RimWorld. We're in Alpha 13, and our have our colony of, well, I guess we're Grizzlies Hope this time. Yeah, we've got our one grizzly bear here, who ate something, and it didn't fight back. So, I guess it was a rabbit or something. I haven't seen any other predators on the map, so I'm assuming... That that is it. Michael is still working away. Great and steel. Good, good, good. If he can work his way down into this cluster here, we'll have all kinds of it. Otherwise, we do have something in here that one of these episodes will break open. But we've been at least two episodes now without any kind of a problem. And that's a problem. Because that's going to turn into a problem soon. <laughs> <laughs> I did go through between episodes and lay out a lot more of these little grids in here so we can kind of tap our way through all of the different uh, mountains and see what goods are hiding in there. There's a lot of steel down here. It's just so far away. But as long as Grizzly behaves and nothing else shows up, we've got pretty much free reign of the map. So we're free to do those kind of things. It's just that while Michael's down here working, I forget about him and I'm busy doing all of this. Uh, Cather is cleaning, good. Klaus is hauling. No, he's, is he really hauling? Click, click. He is hauling. Wow. That'd be the first steel brought to a stockpile in a long time. Michael's probably grabbing some kind of a meal. Oh, uh, there is meal. So I'm going to look at this. Yep. And he'll need to rest soon. So, tell you what. We'll let him just mine out in this area next. Good. I was hoping this would get done. So we can set this to mine as well. So, the wall is there. We want two wide and two wide. Is that right? That's right, so this doesn't need to be mined here, correct? Yeah, a hallway of two, out to this span here, hallway of two. Alright, deconstruct that, and we're good. There's our lower hallway. So, when we do get a buggin... Hello, what are you doing? Oh, you're trying to make spirit releasable. Actually, we'll turn that off. We're probably never going to actually do that. I really want hauling or rescuing, but that's not available. <clears throat> okay. So that's as far as spirits... Well... Tell you what, if it happens, it happens. What do we got here? I didn't see. I probably canceled it out. Let's undo that. I don't see spirit doing much in the way of attacks. It's just going to get spirit killed. So we won't do that on Spirit. Remy, though, be nice to get these done. Um, here, Wildness, 80%. So I wonder what... Naturally more difficult to tame, train, and handle. Okay. Rabbits. Uh, rabbit. Be easier to just click on you. No. Okay, this way. Rabbit. Character. Animals, 10. Probably not enough for wargs. You are butchering. Kippling. Okay. We do need to sell off a bunch of chickens. They are eating us out of kibble really quick. Otherwise, how are we doing in, in regard to uh, getting food stored up? A little worried about these potatoes that we don't seem to be using. Apparently we're going to use the best potatoes first. Is that how it's going to work? Maybe that's a thing now. But Rabbit is going to tame an alpaca. Okay. And Eric is building. i laying out floor and everything else. Alright, that's fine. I want to get somebody to do some hauling. Ronnie, what are you doing? You're going to bed. Let's haul before you go to bed. Try to get your, your day schedule set up a little bit closer to everybody else. So let's 
stress you out a little bit. Although you may be going to get... No, you're not going to get treatment. Okay. And Dwayne, you're consuming a fine meal. But before you do, bring some of these in. I want the stuff not to be rotting out in the field. Vapa is planting. <laughs> and as soon as you're done, you're going to haul these in. There. Selma's been injured. What happened to Selma? Tortoise. You went after a turtle. Yep, 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 yep. Michael is having fun in there. Though I really could use that pathway mined out first. Let's do that before you go to bed tonight. And we have sheared an alpaca. Uh, Selma's fully healed. So 120 alpaca wool. Now, I've never really got a chance to go through and specialize my uh, all my different uh, production tables. I like to have a little room with storage and a production pr uh, production table outside of it, and all of its storage nearby. It's kind of the idea for here, but it just didn't happen. I see we need to get lighting down here, too. Right, let's do that while I'm thinking of it. Architect, furniture... So I don't know what to do about the production production tables. It's kind of hard to say production tables. That's going to go there. Um, let's see. We're going to smooth the flooring there. We're going to put in... Let's put in a full-size bed. Double bed. Wood. Uh, try that again. There we go. Yeah, we could do that. There and there. And there. This one will be smooth floors as well. Floor smooth. Like that. This is going to be wall as soon as this gets mined out. And Michael's still up somewhere. He didn't make the trip, did he? Yeah, we're going to have to do this manually. Okay, let's try once again. You come over here. <coughs> probably got to about here and decided this was the closest mining job and went back. That must be... Odd the color changes there. Huh. All right, one more time. Mine here. I should restart your timer. And then mine there. That should get you in, right? If you read it, reevaluate right here, you'll probably go to that square. Let's see if that happens. Now nope, we made it. Okay, work on that one, and then this one. Let's get this pathway. You are resting. No, come on. Let's get this done. Huh. I think I'm going to let you rest. I want to get you your day-night cycle back to normal. You're supposed to be up at night and uh, asleep during the day. I could force you to with with this. Maybe I'm going to have to just to get that back again. So let's set your sleep to sleep. There we go. Dwayne. 8, 9, and 10, and Michael, 8, 9, and 10. Maybe that will realign your your schedules a little bit. Okay. Heard Flash making a noise, our grizzly. It reminded me to take a peek over at this wild grizzly and see what he's up to. <clears throat> kind of hard to see him in the fog. It says clear. There's no grizzly in this area, is there? Have you gone further up in the map? Cathra, what are you up to? You're cleaning rubble out here. You must have run out of things to do. Okay, take you off of cleaning then. Cathra, cleaning is now a two, so you're gonna default to your next two, which is plant cut. Yes, we desperately need that. I'm gonna cut some resting. <laughs> well, tomorrow you will cut trees. 
All right, little by little, we are getting this done. Wood flooring. Here. And we lost everything, so let's get back to furniture. Standing lamp goes there. Ah, we lost the vent. How are we going to vent into this room? Can we vent across from this guy? Will it be blocked? I guess we need to figure that out. You cancel. Standing lamp is actually going to go here. And we're going to power temperature vent here. Will not let us. Okay. Don't know how to deal with that. Now that is deep inside. So we're not going to get the fluctuations of outside temperature. We're going, although... Oh, they fixed that. Up to Alpha 12, when you would pass over the mountain, what was a, Oh, this isn't originally mountain. This one is. You know, any of the original walls, like this guy. Outdoor 72. But you get, looks like, just a couple of spaces in, and it's indoors. I see. you got to be three out to get to outdoors. Okay. Alpha 12, anytime you touch original stone, it was outdoor temperature. And so it would transmit that temperature into your interior, just like that. So you need to put wood walls up around all the, the old uh, mountain in order to insulate it. So I see they fixed that. So this one may not need to be vented because it's just going to have the other indoor temperatures around it slowly creep in. So I don't think it's going to get cold in the winter because these will all be warm here. We'll go with that. See if that's true. I think I can skip this one. I think that's still one two three to get out or one two three to get out or one two i don't think that's a weak point for this room but it is time to get this one in and that's got to move to there and unfortunately we can't just move it so we're going to deconstruct it this is going to move reinstall oh we'll reinstall there we will build a granite wall there. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So that's going to stay there. This is going to become a new vent. This uh, temperature vent here. And we can't do it because space already occupied. Because of the conduit? <laughs> okay. Where's Ronnie? Ronnie's hauling. Good. Well, Nettie, what are you doing? You're hauling wood for double bed. All right, let's let you. Whoa, really? Hmm. Well, in that case, haul all the wood. That's 73. That's close enough. And when you get to about here, we'll have you work on the double bed. And then we'll give that to Ronnie, and we'll start working on this room. So in that case... There. Pause. Well, okay, you can come closer. Get into there. All right. Do double bed, and then do double bed. There you go. And Michael, you're gone. You're grabbing a meal. Otherwise, needs are okay. So finish that meal, and let's get these. You're playing horseshoes. Well, you do get joy from your work. Thankfully, you, you enjoy mining. So let's get this pathway cut through and then get you back out and make more steel. Nettie didn't get the job done. Already constructing, so you're going to find more wood. All right. 
So you punch through these three, and then I'll set you loose down there. And then I can stop micromanaging for a while. Oh, that bed's done. And it's superior. Okay, Ronnie, you now live there. So I can rebuild your room. Close. And then Cathra can live here. And that... No, no, no. Let's... Finish this. Is your joy really that bad? It's a bit rough, but it is increasing right now. Just got to plow through this. One more. Just got a roof right there. Interesting. And one more. You go ahead and do what you want. So soon I'll send you down there to the uh, to the iron mine. All right, Nettie is building that. Can you, though, be sure to do this? Grab all that wood. <laughs> so many times they'll dump all the wood everywhere else and still not have enough to do the job. Oh, 70 of 70. What are you doing now? You're consuming a fine meal after you finish the bed. Now you've earned a fine meal. Normal job. Hmm, should have had ropes to it. Didn't think of that. Darn. Okay, but that one is going to be Catherine's for now. A sign. So Dwayne now has his own room. Vapen now has his own room, which he's going to go make use of. So with that, everybody's got a bedroom again, and we have one spare. We've got... A hospital there and we could tear this whole thing out and do something else with it we don't need the double doors anymore speaking of double doors okay let's set up a ha ah, a barrier what do, you, what do you call those not an airlock a uh, a bulkhead that's what I'm thinking let's set up a bulkhead against bug invasions and let's see, before I'm thinking about it, that power just came on, which means we got steel, which means I need more steel. So Michael, I need you out here on this one. And I'll have to wait to make sure that, uh, that you get there. Right, let's start the timer over again and work on this one. So this room's available to work on. We can start gutting all of this. And now let's have you work on this one. And it looks like I need to add those two. Okay, Bear needs, you're gonna be feisty here real soon. With only a squirrel and a couple of turtles. Hmm, well, you're on the other side of the of the mountain from Michael, so he should be safe. You did that and quit? Huh? Your joy's fine. No, no, no. Let's 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 work on this a little bit more. Come on, you can you can do this. Just plow through. <laughs> I need the steel. Alright, we're going to force you to do at least one more before you're done. Ah, now you're good. Area revealed, right there. Okay, there we go. So, you're content now. Good, good, good. Nettie is... resting. She needs a medical bed. Oh, we just accidentally made a hospital. Interesting. Okay, then. What is our plan here? Let's... hate to do this, but let's mine that out. Who can do that? 
Brooks, you're a miner, too. You are building a wooden door, but really, if you could at least pop that one for me. Let's set this one to stay open. Oh, I'm going to double wall these. I really need to double wall this right here also. That could be a problem, huh? Hmm. Now maybe I didn't need to double wall between. I don't know. Um, I didn't see that. You did do that one, though. Let's get that rebuilt real fast, because that's letting hot air in. So, structure, granite. Yeah, we'll do granite. And rabbit is taming a boomalo. Great. But where did Rokes disappear to? Boy, he's fast. There you are. Drop what you're doing. Ah, rabbit. Haul that stone out of there first. And Rokes. Well, you hopefully won't get too far away before you... Okay, do this one for me. Rabbit. Tending to Ronnie. Well, that is more important. Okay, so that's taken care of. Okay. Brand is making more clothing. What are we making? We suspended parkas because they weren't needed. We have 11 of 3. Okay. Uh, making dusters. That's actually a good idea. In fact, it looks like they're swapping out for dusters now because dusters will keep you cooler, right? Let me look at that. I don't see a duster out here. Okay, let's do it this way. Let's look at a parka. And... Cloth parka. Alright, staying warm in even the coldest of temperatures. Let's look at a duster. Gear. Duster. Information. Alright, block in the sun. And the grit of the desert. Uh, how do you read this? So, heat plus 29 degrees and cold. So, is that good until? I'm not sure how this works. Hmm. But I'm pretty sure the dusters are meant to keep you cool, whereas the parkas are meant to keep you warm. So, you want them to put on dusters in the summertime and put on... Uh, just thought I heard a gunshot, but there shouldn't be any. And then put on a parka for the winter time. And they seem to be doing that automatically right now. Okay. So our grizzly was going to eat soon. He's right here. Visitors. And he just ate a squirrel. And he's fine. Visitors, what do we have? Uh, the city of the tree colony visiting us. Jump to... No traders. Oh, there is a trader. Ooh. You probably don't have a lot of iron on you, though, do you? Darn. You bringing the pigs? No. They're already out here. Okay. Well, let's remember they're coming. It's quite often that uh, they take a long time to get here, and I forget all about them by the time we actually need them. You know, it's also quite often that when we have a raid, we also have visitors. What's the chance that we've got a raid about to hit? As these visitors walk in. Hmm. Ronnie's asleep still. Fine. It was Nettie that went over here? Or was it Ronnie that went in there? Health. No treatment. Klaus, where are you at? Now, Ronnie did get done. Needs. Just need food and rest and you'll be fine. And Klaus. Not seeing... There you are. Health. Mild pain, needs, you're going to be fine too. Okay, that's working well. Michael did a little more than took off. He's sleeping now. Okay then, this guy's on his way in. Dwayne's out there looking for more. And we need more of the granite. How are we doing on granite? Using it, well, we are ahead a little bit. And we're mostly built. Huh. Maybe it's time to put a limit on this guy then. Bills. Details. Do until. Granite. Let's do until. Until you have. 
and pause so that's not suspended currently have oh blocks in total okay so that's not going to help us okay is there anything else we want Dwayne to be doing I guess is what it comes down to so Dwayne actually let's go this way work and let's remember our visitors they're just walking in work Dwayne crafting is what he's having the most fun at though he has fun in here too okay he would like to go hunting but he hunts with a switchblade so that's right or am I thinking of let's see here Dwayne yeah you, Dwayne you were a melee well, you hunt with a gladius. Okay. But still, that's not what you want to go after big game with. Huh. Tell you what. Let's... Hmm. First of all, Michael, I want you working on steel. So we got to watch that, make sure it happens. But do I want to switch... To all blocks instead of just granite. There's probably no reason to build with anything else except the advantage is that we can start using some of the blocks that are already here rather than have them walk across the whole map. Let's limit the. Let's do this. That one. And first of all, Michael, let's reassign you to that one. Okay. And let's reprioritize this this way. Details. You're going to be do forever with granite only, but only to a radius of hit points inequality. Radius, there you are. Why am I running? Why is that not showing anymore? Because it goes off the map. Okay down until that shows to 56 and we'll let the haulers bring it in so he can be doing other things now Michael one last time let's have you do that one all right that should get you there okay so we're a half hour into this one and still no raid but we're getting the colony finally built and that's important too granite wall right there so tell you what let's let's work on Dwayne a little bit more when he's not crafting because there aren't any more granite blocks he could be out cutting trees that's his next assignment we do need the wood still don't see any in the list here no nope, no wood in, in at least in our stockpiles so Although there is a lot here. All right, let's set him for hauling them. There we go. Right one? Dwayne? Haul. Okay. So we can get some of this wood brought in. And... Michael's still there. Good. This guy should be content. Another predator check here. A couple of llamas and boomalopes and... Those dangerous turtles, but nothing that is aggressive. Any other herds that have come in? Boy, there's lots of uh, lots of wild boars out here. Would love to go after them. Lots there. Yeah, let's set some more hunting up. But I still want to take the enough enough time to check for predators. We're fine. We're back to our grizzly. Okay. Let's do all of these wild boars. Hunt. That should keep us out of the boomalop range. So I'd like to not deal with a forest fire unless it starts to rain. Hmm. Okay. Well, that'll trigger Ronnie. Who is probably already heading out. Eric? Building marble. Ooh, we're going to get our crematorium in. Good. Alright, down in here. 
We need a plan. What is the space? What is that space? Is it new storage? And that's right, I never get to finish this one. That's where I was when I got interrupted. Let's do that first. Bulkhead there. Bulkhead there. Granite door there, there. All right, so we're somewhat controlled here. And what happens here? That got built. Stone wall. There. There. This can go away, I think. Let's deconstruct this area. That can go away. Trebo's our only prisoner. Bulkhead's going in there. This can become the hospital. Good bed. Good bed. Let's uh, uninstall these guys. You guys are good, normal, superior. You get relocated to... there. Otherwise we're going to build bed. Alright. That's access there. We don't necessarily need another doorway. So let's just... Do we want the air conditioner going through the hospital to get into the rest of the place? How about a hallway right here? That could work. What are you? Your marble auto door. That doesn't need to be there. Let's cancel that one. Let's put a structure granite wall there. Single wall. Yeah. You go away. Deconstruct. Let's put a wooden door. Uh, structure wooden door here. And we need another vent in there. Temperature, vent, that can go there. And as soon as that's all done, we'll finish that wall. This is the new hospital. One, two, three, and then one, two, three, four, seven beds in there. And that'll be the hospital, that'll be the prison. All of this can start to deconstruct and do other things with and or a couple more bedrooms. This got put in. Good. That is the party spot. So, probably want a wall through here. Oh, they're leaving. Pause. I did not deal with them. There they are. Brand. Hop up and talk to Witch. Hopefully, I think you've got a pretty good run speed. You should catch up. And hopefully you got iron. I will buy every single piece you don't have. Hmm. You've got EMP grenades. That would be smart to have. If we come up against any kind of mechanoid, that pretty much stuns them. I think I'm going to do that. It would be nice just to get one through a, a battle in the future, but I may not have that opportunity. Um, medicines. You do have medicines to sell. I will buy all of them. So now we've got 18. You do have components to sell. I will buy all of those. Kibble. You've got two kibble. Sure. Is that all you've got? What you don't have is a... or what you have left is a survival rifle. Okay. You're willing to buy meals. Or our pistol. Hmm. Nope, I think we'll call this good. Except. Pause. Brand. Haul in the medicine. Medicine. Needs to live right there. Stockpile. Right now, it is just loose in here. So actually, 
stockpile needs to go probably like that. You are going to be all medicine but herbal. So storage, you're going to be clear all, <clears throat> critical. Now to find medicine. Not in foods, you're not in raw. You are in like manufactured or something like that. You're not... Oh, you are there. Okay. That one, that one. And that's good. There's nothing else that they use here. Now, I do have the option of the... Boy, I need that that advanced research going. The, uh, uh, the medical... Okay, research. Vitals monitor. I want to get that one going. But I've got to get the... Miscellaneous multi-analyzer going, which I have lost the space for it to go. Yeah, we'll probably bump out this wall here and put it right there. Yeah, right? I didn't already have that set up somewhere. No, but I need plasteel and gold to do that. Now, where's Michael at? I left him down here. Hey, he did a great job. Oh, good. So we've got a lot of steel now. I always need to get a hauled in. Otherwise, he's... Well, I'm kind of losing my bearings here. He was there. So he's not in bed. He's over here tunneling through and exploring. Okay. Before you do that, or instead of that, can you finish that off? And then we'll let us put the last of the blocks in and call this room done. And we need to get conduit in here, apparently. But before I do that, you're going to change your mind here in just a second. So let's have you do that one instead. And that may be close enough to say, heck with it all, I'm going to bed. <laughs> um, conduit. Architect. Power. Yeah, let's head up into here and shoot across this whole place. And that'll be fine. Do we just put two more bedrooms in here? I'm kind of thinking that footprint looks like that footprint. That may be the thing to do. And then we're set, we're future-proofed for any other colonists. This can be one wall thick, too. This one would need to be doubled. You know, I think that's the answer. Let's structure wall. One, two, three, four. Right in there. That didn't work. Or that is granite, yeah. Hallway too wide. So essentially we're looking like that, but this... This doesn't need to be a double wall or a double wall either. One, two, three, four. That can be there. Do we have room to put one more in here? One, two. Let's mine that out. Orders, mine. One, two, three, four. And then a double wall. Five, six. Like that. Cargo pods. I don't need a double wall. Pause. Cancel. Need just a single wall to not have the raw stone there. So that'll need to come out too. Let's deal with cargo pods. Jump to location. Ooh. Human meat. No. Let's leave it there. Let the animals have it. I'm not bringing that in. Okay. We're running? We're not. Okay. So build a stone wall there and need to mine out this stone wall there. Which means we need to put a wall, granite, there, and probably there. Okay. So, that is rain, isn't it? Foggy rain. Need a builder. Ropes. Got a builder. Hauling wood? Nope. Haul stone. Do that one. Secure us back over here. And you're clearing this stuff out. Let's get wall built over here. And let's tunnel, or mine, this. Yeah, that's working. 
We have enough stone for a while. This needs to get moved. Who's a mover? Klaus, you're hauling. Let's have you. Take that to there and just drop it. And let's get rid of this one. Cannot haul nowhere to go. Alright. You continue on and we'll think about where to go. Where would there be an advantage for us to have some stone? We're using sandbags as our quick little uh, points of, of hiding or uh, cover. Huh. Well, let's just get nearby. Nearby and convenient. Let's do zone, dumping pile. Oh, something like that. And something like that. Over here? Maybe something like that. Kind of duplicate this thing. In fact, let's just... There we are. Copy. Paste. We have rain, don't we? We do have rain. Paste. Let's take out some... Hunt. Some wild boars out over here. All of them. Hunt. And let's turn Eric back on to hunting for this. Let's get all of the hunting near the boomalopes done. So, Eric, you were artificially put up higher there. Let's bring you back to there. We'll do that for now, since we don't have the multi-analyzer going. We won't worry about putting the... Uh, uh, worry about the research just yet. Let's get you to hunt right now. You've got the sniper rifle. Ronnie was where hunting? Ronnie. You were down here already. Okay. So we'll do the hunting down there. Kind of a bad time to go look for carnivores, but I'm curious to see if anything new has jumped onto the map. Or where Grizzly is. <clears throat> he doesn't seem to be down in this corner anymore. Where has he wandered to? Seems like he was over he here last. Okay, he's still there. Needs. You're going to eat again soon. There's not a lot of, uh, of game out here. Yeah. We're going to be the game before long. Alright, once you eat again, then I'll bring Michael back down here. Otherwise, you know what? There's a lot of wood out here, and it's rotting. Cathra, we're taking you off of cutting. We're turning you into a hauler. Cathra, haul, and plant cut. You're back to hauling. Let's stop cutting. And haul as much of that in as possible. Klaus... You are hauling, and I'm thankful for that. Let's get you to haul wood. Let's fill this guy with, with wood. Um, closest is where? Let's grab that one over there. And let's extend this stockpile over here. So, stockpile, you are going to now be that and that. And... Steel stockpile. Let's do that as well. We have two hunters now. That's always a little worrisome. Wish I had more charge rifles. They seem to work pretty good for most of what we need to do. Though the sniper is good for a siege. Yeah, I'm worried about things like this. This wild boar right in the middle of all these guys. Though by the time they finally get to hunting him he could be clear over here. So there's no way to predict who to choose to hunt and who not to. You just gotta kind of babysit it. So we will babysit it until the rain ends then we'll turn them all off. Um, Michael is sleeping. Good. 
we're still secure. We're building, oh, 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 we're building more bedrooms. I just meant that temporarily. Okay, you can go away. Let's stop this for a while. You're going to do these two, that's fine. Let's structure door. Wooden door there. Wooden door there. Mm. Yeah, for symmetry it'll look good. Let's vent. Temperature. Vent. There. And we'll vent here. We will wooden floor. Was I supposed to be babysitting somebody? Wooden floor there. And there. There. And there. Already occupied. Okay. Uh, hunting. As well as uh, wood being hauled in. So Cathra is hauling stoned out over there. That's not as critical as bringing in all of this. So yeah, we're going to have to... There's no way, unfortunately, that I can say just bring in all the wood. Is there? If this was set to critical, would they concentrate on filling that first? I've never thought about that. Let's find out. Do they... Hmm. If they go to haul wood, they'll take it to the most critical stockpile. But I've never thought about whether a critical stockpile will draw them to go out and get something to fill it. That'd be interesting to see. Dwayne is hauling wood. That might be a coincidence. He may have been right here, and that was the closest thing to haul. So we'll see if Cathra repeats her orders when she gets in there. If so, then... Boy, that's a great discovery. All the time I play RimWorld, I've never thought about trying that. You're going to do what? Nope. You're going to back to the nearest falling job. Okay. Too good to be true. You're going to do that one. And Dwayne is bringing in that wood there. Uh, Klaus just went to bed. I was just going to send you out there. Ronnie, though, is shooting. Okay, we'll leave her alone. Nettie is sleeping. Dwayne is playing horseshoes after you bring in even more wood. Thank you. I need the steel too, but it doesn't degrade in the weather. So it's the wood that's got to be brought in as well as all the food. Oh, this is killing me. This really is. We're going to have to uh, designate a bunch of hauling, aren't we? Alright, Ronnie just hauled hers in. Eric is going to Take his out, moving target, and moving away, so he's going to have to get a little closer. Just need one good shot with that rifle. Give you one more try. Yep, I need you here. Foggy rain still. A little closer, and then if I reset you, will you go straight to hunt? You won't. Consuming a fine meal after you hunt this guy. Oh, so close. A couple more, then we'll head off and check the other thing. Going for this one, right? Or was it that one? Who was this one? So close. One more. Oh, that must have just hit next to his foot. Ah, he moved. Okay, have fun with that. And... Michael's up. Good. Where at? Pause. Alright, let's find you this way. Right over there. Be nice when these are done, you'll stop heading this way, but I really want this done here. Bear is moving awfully fast. You're hunting, aren't you? Hunting a hare. Rokes is collecting. That was closer than Rokes had a clue. Michael... One over the top. Down here. Alright, one more time. Let's actually go for this one then. And... Architect, zone, no roof in that area. Clear no roof. No, no roof there. 
Yeah, no roof in here if it'll let me. It'll let me go that far. No roof there. Michael, mine that one. Okay, I need haulers. I need it bad. Work. We probably have enough construction done to get by for a while. I think so. Whoa, poison ship. So much for hauling. Okay. And actually, we're coming up on the end of the episode, aren't we? Yeah. I think I'm going to stop recording for tonight. So this episode, you'll be able to leave comments on, and I'll actually get them before I start uh, recording more. There is a way around this, and I need to know what you think. Because this is pretty dangerous. What you could do is send Dwayne after it. Dwayne and Klaus. Yeah, a few of them. But the tactic that I have seen is to set a wall like that. No, well, probably... Is that the... Maybe that's considered the door. Let's do it this way. Now we'll go a little further. So to do something like... that... And, or actually, just to make sure it doesn't fail, we'll do something like that. I'm not sure what the spacing is, but when you go to attack this ship, mechanoids are going to pop out of it. And if you set a melee guy right here, he can reach in and attack it, but they can't get to him to shoot him. So there's kind of a... A, a way of, of gaming the system to make that work. Uh, probably best to put in a marble door or granite. We're using granite, right? Both of these? Yeah. Granite door in there in case they build themselves in. But this guy is going to start poisoning the ground. It's a poison ship. I only got one, right? Let's read this. A large piece of an ancient ship has crashed nearby. It is leaking toxic materials and will kill all the plants in an expanding circle around itself. Destroy it as soon as possible. But, oh, I should have... Let me just make sure. Last time I got a poison ship in a game, it threw three of them at me at once. Okay, no others. But it will eventually poison everything, including the trees. We're going to lose everything in this area. And eventually it's going to get big enough to start taking out all our crops. So we want to get rid of this, but once we tap on it to start to destroy it, it's going to dump mechanoids on us. So we can, and until the mechanoids are going to guard the ship until it gets to 50% or less, then they will go through our traps and bang, 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 and then, you know, all that stuff. We could be firebombing this too, kind of. Uh, so this way we can get the ship down to less than 50% without the mechanoids killing us trying to do that. And then when they finally bust their way through, they will head through the gauntlet. We can flee to safety and let the gauntlet and the traps do the job. That's the idea. And I think I'm going to do that. I think so. Just because I've kind of grown attached to this little group here, and I'd really hate to lose one of them. It'd be nice to actually see everybody in here make it off planet. But that is for the next episode. But I think that is our plan. Leave me your thoughts in the comments and tell me what you think of that. Is that too cheaty or is that just playing smart? What do you think? Let me know. This has been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching. Hit that like and subscribe down there if you would. And I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.